there, it's Justin from Hans Wargaming. Today we're going to be building a rugged outpost stationed on top of a desert mesa. A mesa is a uh, flat topped ridge or a hill that stands above the surrounding landscape with steep escarpments on all sides. Mesas generally have a more angular pile of rocks down at the base of them, kind of sitting at a 45 degree angle. Usually they come up a lot higher than they do on this particular project, but since I'm working on such a small scale, I kind of had to adjust the proportions a little bit, and I think it turned out looking pretty good. I don't think it looks uh, too unnatural. If you want a more detailed tutorial on Desert Rocks, uh, check out my video on that, or check out my website where I have a blog post on this as well. I put a lot of work into this project, so if you could uh, comment down below and hit the subscribe button, I would really appreciate it. But for now, just sit back and enjoy the video. So once I had a base coat of Maj Podge and paint on this thing, I started uh, just adding paint, just layering a bunch of colors on sporadically and trying to get a more natural look to it. I had a piece from each of my previous projects sitting on the table. I was kind of trying to match uh, those two colors, even though they kind of came out a little bit different. I was kind of trying to go for a uh, middle ground color scheme between those two projects. I'd say the color scheme ended up looking a little bit more like the boneyard that I did. So I did a couple rough sketches in Photoshop trying to get an idea of how I wanted to lay out the walkways. I knew I wanted to do like half in uh, metal and half in wood. I started by sticking a bunch of skewers into the foam to try and figure out where I wanted my beams to be. That really helped me to uh, visualize what the thing would actually look like when it was done. I used stir sticks for a lot of things in this project. Uh, for one, I made the eye beams out of those.
once I had all the walkways built, I started adding uh, corrugated cardstock, which I bought on Amazon. This looks a lot like those uh, larger corrugated metal sheets that you see on some structures. I'm sure you've seen it before. This is something a lot of crafters use. It is pretty brittle though, so when I painted it, I mixed some Maj Podge in with the paint to kind of harden it up a little bit. And I also glued some uh, popsicle sticks that I cut up onto the back of the cardstock to help add a little bit more structure as well. To build the ladders, I used a, a similar technique to one that I saw in a Blackmagic Craft video where he, uh, he used double-sided tape to uh, tape the ladders down to keep them in place while he glued on the rungs. Uh, I didn't have double-sided tape, so I just taped down uh, a piece of tape with another piece of tape. And that pretty much achieved the same thing. For the antenna, I used one half of an old respirator filter, and then I glued a couple pieces of hardware onto a paint cap and stuck that on top of the uh, respirator filter. I wasn't originally planning on building any kind of a structure to go with this uh, outpost, but it looked like it needed one. So I decided to build one out of cardboard. And then I just put the corrugated card stock around that and uh, put a little bit of trim on it. Uh, I cut out a door and a few windows and I didn't glue it down or anything. I just kind of shaped it so it could sit on a certain spot on top of the mesa, or I could uh, just sit it on the ground if I wanted to. Overall, I'm pretty happy with how that came out.